Welcome to Newsletter Guru TV, your show with a boatload of smart marketing and business building advice and a little fun along the way. This episode of Newsletter Guru TV is brought to you by Jim Palmer's Create Your Dream Business Now Academy, a -a one-of-a-kind live event where Jim will personally teach you how to market and grow a more profitable business faster, even in a crappy economy. During this event, Jim will reveal how to create a million-dollar platform on a shoestring budget. You'll learn how to generate a ton of content with ease, how to attract a steady stream of new customers, and you'll also network with other successful marketers and entrepreneurs. This not-to-be-missed event is September 4th through the 6th in beautiful Philadelphia and will quite literally transform your business. Do not miss it. Get all the details and register today at www.dreambizacademy.com. Hey everybody, Jim Palmer, the News Editor Guru, your dream business coach, and I'm committed to helping you build a more profitable business faster. And it may look like I'm smiling, but you know what? I'm a little sad today. You know why? (laughs) Because it has rained like the third or fourth day in a row. So, number one, it means I'm not down in my floating office, and number two, I can't even shoot a video out in my backyard. I'm inside my office in the middle of July, so, but you know, the show must go on. And today, you know, last couple of weeks, I've shared with you some, what I would consider some mindset things, and today we're going to turn a little bit more tactical. First of all, being in my office, I get a lot of work done. I can just, like, close out all the, all, every, all the, um, what is the right word, Jim? All the interruptions and I get stuff done. As a matter of fact, I just finished. In fact, we mailed it yesterday. This is an eight page sales letter that's going out to everybody that's on my uh, mailing list. And this is about the Dream Business Academy coming up uh, September 4th, 5th, and 6th in Philadelphia. So if you're on my mailing list, you are going to be seeing a copy of that in your mailbox soon. So that got done. And that takes an enormous amount of work. But you know what? That's what. That's what it's all about, right? Anyway, um, so I want to talk with something. I want to talk with something. I want to talk with, wow, I am so out of sorts. Is being inside and not down on my boat. It's driving me crazy. So let's go. Take two. I want to talk with you today about something very, very simple, but it's very important. And it's very important to helping you build your email list. Now, yes, email is still a very popular way to market. It is only one part of your million dollar platform. So if you're relying on just email alone, I suspect you're seeing a very bad decline in the number of people that are coming into your um, into your community. But make no question about it, email is still alive and well, but it just needs to be one part of your overall marketing campaign. And um, I've helped a couple of my coaching clients recently create some, uh, some new websites. And um, one of the things about building an opt-in that I wanted to share with you today a lot of people will just throw up an opt-in box because they want to build a list. And it's going to say, um, subscribe to our newsletter. Eh, no good. And it's going to say, uh, join our mailing list. Eh, no good. And then there'll be another box that'll say, enter your email here for fast updates or we'll keep you alert of new things or, you know, whatever's going on, which is, which is, you know, code for, hey, we're going to tell you when our new product's out and we'll bombard your email. You know, the fact of the matter is nobody, and I mean nobody, is looking to receive more email. Nobody's looking to get a free newsletter. Nobody's looking for much of anything if you describe it like that. What you want to do is create a lot of people refer to it as an ethical bribe. So an ethical bribe is where you very ethically, so the key word is you're going to give something of value in exchange for their email. And what's really important, and I spend a lot of time um, helping my clients and my own websites do this in a correct way. So first of all, unless unless this has changed, and I don't think it has, the best place for opt-in is still in the upper right-hand part of your website. All right, But what you want to do is first of all have a killer opt-in, a good, very good ethical bribe. So don't just say uh, free report, and don't just say get a get a get a free audio, download MP3 of this or that or the other thing. So you want to first of all name the free reports, name the audio, whatever you're going to make up. And by the way, I suggest, um, for lack of a better description, create a nice little goodie bag of things. So don't just have one thing, have several things. So in your goodie bag, make make sure each one has a captivating headline, speaking. 
to the benefit of why they would want to have it. Why did they come to your website in the first place? The next thing you want to do is create images for each thing. So even if it's a free report like a PDF, go to Fiverr or have somebody design for you a nice cover, a nice 3D cover so it looks like something of value instead of just a free report. Do that for audio as well. You can picture, make a picture of a CD as long as your description is correct, you know, downloadable MP3. The image is what they're going to see. And then if you're giving an ebook, you know, or something like that, have a picture of an ebook. So you got captivating headlines, you got full pictures, you got descriptions, and a nice box. Um, so let me show you a couple sites. First of all, I'll show you this is one of my sites. This is thenewslettersguru.com. All right, so at thenewslettersguru.com, what you're seeing there is says, you know, claim. Your free money making videos, special report, and book chapters now. And so, in that image, you're seeing a picture of a video. You're seeing uh, first, I give away um, either one or two chapters from four of my books and all this and that. So, it's it looks pretty elaborate. The other thing it says is um, download instantly, all right? And then it says download now. And then, step two on my page, after about five seconds, I use something called a light box. And that's what that's what you'll see there. Here's a website for one of my coaching clients, just happens to be my daughter Jessica, for interviewconnections.com where she books uh, amazing guests and look on the upper right hand side you'll see her opt-in box and again how to get massive exposure as a guest expert and make your podcast boom. So it's a very benefit um, laden headline and then again immediate access, free information, download now, very very important. This is another one of my coaching clients. This is a VIP member, Dr. Carrie Drizga, and um, she is into functional medicine, so that's very important in the headline. But in with her opt-in box, we have free reports. So again, free reports. Free is still a very, very big word in marketing. Immediate access. We have pictures of the reports. These are PDF reports, but we generated nice pictures for her. Immediate access, and then we name them. Bonus report. Fatigue factors 9 to 14 reclaim your energy and feel normal again. The second one, six truths you need to hear about natural treatments for fatigue, like it or not, and then a consumer awareness guide to functional medicine for fatigue sufferers. Download now. Another very big thing is your information will not be shared. So you'll see there's a big difference from get on our mailing list, sign up for our free newsletter, put your email in here, get updates. You know, you when someone comes to your website, you want to ethically bribe them with some really good information. Now, some people ask me, well, Jim, how much information should I give? You want to give as much information as you need to so they get on your list because that's your objective. Getting them on your list so you can then drip market to them. In other words, keep them on your email list. So whether it's through newsletters, whether it's through videos, podcasts, e-zines, whatever it is, your blog, emails, just communicating with them through autoresponders that you can nurture and develop that relationship. Keep sharing more information. It's very much akin to, you know, when I was in the franchising business, I remember this company called Auntie Anne's Pretzels got in franchising just when we did with the um, company Bike Line. And um, Auntie Anne's, whenever they opened a pretzel place in a new mall, they would give away pretzels the entire day for free. Why did they do that? Because they wanted people to sample what they were offering. When people sampled it, they got hooked on it and they came back and bought tons and tons of pretzels. Very much the same way, if you go in an ice cream parlor, you got that little uh, wooden spoon, or I guess they're white plastic now, and what you can do is ask for samples. Samples the ice, sample the ice cream, you decide which one you're then going to purchase. It's, it, there's so many different examples that I could give you, but basically what you want to do is get people to sample some of what you're offering, whether it's your intelligence, your information, uh, in the case of Dr. Carey, how she can help you with fatigue and, and, and other, and other um, things going on in your world. So it's a great way. They, so they come to the website through SEO, through marketing for other things, and then they get on the list. Then you can start drip marketing and, and nurture and develop that relationship. So eventually, some or hopefully all, that'd be nice, all the people will eventually start buying your programs. Okay, that's really it. I, I just really wanted to jump in front of the camera here and give you um, something very, very tactical. It's almost kind of old school, but hey, there's people creating internet business and internet based businesses all the time so that's what you want to do with your website I told you what to avoid and I told you how to build an opt-in box that will have people jumping onto your email list so you can grow 
grow that list and nurture and develop those relationships. Okay, cool. Um, that is just one of the things, by the way, that I'll be teaching how to build your list at my Dream Business Academy. It's coming up September 4th, 5th, and 6th in Philadelphia. And I will show you how to build your own million dollar platform on a shoestring budget. I'm going to reveal all the different ways that I have built my business and that I continually market all my different businesses today uh, without spending a whole lot of money. So that's just one of the things we'll be doing. Check that out at dreambizacademy.com, www.dreambizacademy.com. Be sure to check out Stick Like Glue Radio. It's the only podcast dedicated to helping you build or create an unbearable good I just screwed that up really bad <laughs> no let's see go to stick like glue radio it's the only podcast dedicated to help you create an unbear unshakable bond what is that word where's my book an everlasting bond it's really really late in the day how to create an everlasting bond with your customers so they stay longer spend more and refer more and that's all a great thing in your business before the day's out I'm making up for lost time before the day's out look for ways that you can add more value to your customers what you're doing for them so they stay longer it's always a good thing because we know when customers stay longer they're gonna spend more and refer more again great things finally go put a smile on some stranger's face one random act of kindness at a time wave them into traffic just say hi, smile at them, tell them, hey, I like your coat, whatever it is, just make somebody smile today. And if everybody does that, the world's going to be a much nicer place, and that would be very, very cool. That is it for today. Until another great episode of Newsletter Guru TV next week, my name is Jim Palmer, the Newsletter Guru, and I am your dream business coach. You take good care.